Park? Uh, my name is Kevin Park. I work at the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York City. Uh, my job is uh, design and production manager in digital media department. Okay, great. Yeah. Uh, so we were talking about the digital collection and the management of digital collections. Right. Um, so you said the math is doing a whole lot of work on this yes. and it's been going on for a while. Yeah. Um, so we have a system called TMS and we have an image library called MediaBin. And so we have two teams working on this separately. So our TMS team is going through consolidation process last over 10 years, uh, led by Ginny Choi. And they're basically going through old data and new data and putting into a brand new system that has a clear message about consistency, dimensions, objects, uh, chat labels, and other tools and information going in there. And also we have an image library where all the images, video, um, uh, in, uh, it can be a photography or it can be 360, 360 view or things like that. So they also have going through consolidating all that information into one uh, streamlined database. Basically. Right. And all this will be like available for free on the web? Yes and no. Some will, some are not, but most likely will. Uh, in if you go to our website, our main website has access from collections, and also if you go to our uh, feature websites such as Timeline Connections and 82nd and Fib, you see uh, a lot of images you can actually download directly or you can print. Uh, if you go to website, if you go to collections, in here, uh, speed is a little slow go to the first screen and there's a download option there so you can also download that too okay uh, we actually go by the batch like we don't just upload one at a time we just go by let's say hundred thousand images one at a time so uh, that number will grow eventually okay yeah. and like how many items you actually have more or less uh, available on the web you uh, this I think the last time I heard was about 600,000 but it would okay. because we have about tw 2 million objects right. so it will hopefully Grow. reach out to that number okay uh, yeah. okay so and um, is there any specific project you want to mention that you, you did using your uh, digital collection uh, I think the biggest one is probably our um, CRD this collection area you find almost every single image is available from the web and we have uh, other such thing as a timeline of our history uh, has not different set of images but we have a whole other team who does imaging work on this so you can find um, rather different set of images you can see from this compared to the collections and also we have a uh, uh, let's say connections is another one and also there's uh, 82nd and 5th that talks about individual work by the curators so I keep getting these emails and we also have uh, one second uh, met around the wall where you can see uh, where the objects are coming from. Okay. So, so, like, uh, so there's a lot of different resources reference. you can actually go after. Okay. Uh, okay, just one last question then I, uh, I'll stop bothering you. Um, what does this give you in terms of uh, access? I mean, do you have like how many people are reaching out for your content on the web? Um, you mean actual number? Yeah, more or less. I mean, if you know. Yeah, I believe it's over 300 million, but I cannot be quite <laughs> sure about the exact number. But you know, if you send me an email, I can send you the exact number. But um, we know that uh, the numbers grows all the time because you know, even from uh, purely from uh, feature websites such as Timeline, that number grew. This website's been out there for about. 13 years, 14 years, right? and it's been growing ever since. Like yeah. It started maybe started with 10,000, now it's like over 10, 20 million. Okay. So it's just con consistently growing. Okay, yeah. Okay. so you 
you offer a lot in terms of access yeah. to this. Okay. And especially on this website, uh, we see the the duration time grows to, uh, let's say an average of uh, people spend seven seconds to 10 seconds per page, uh, if maximum that way. Right. Uh, timeline, some people spend 30 minutes. Right. Because so they need to study or it's for their writing final exam for the... So know, they engage a lot more yeah. with the content. Okay. Yeah. So that's a whole other way to look at the web content. Like, it's not just uh, um, getting information, but this is where they actually grow their uh, enthusiasm about uh, art history or about the museum itself. So, yeah. Okay, wonderful. Thank you very, very much. No Thanks. problem.